Fahrenheit 451 is a story about a near future in which censorship has really descended on society. So when you're a fireman in this future society, you're not there to put out fires. You're there to burn books. Bradbury was largely responding to the politics of his period, which had to do with a lot of artists being under the gun for stepping out and speaking out for what they believed to be important, the, the important stories that they wanted to tell. The idea of the, the book burning and the information and the ideas, the squelching of new and interesting ideas and, and remember that being a hot topic with my father and my mom and over dinner and talking about that and being really scared about being in a place, living in a world where that would happen. He was a fine conversationalist and, uh, he, and, and it comes out in his work as well. A lot of his work is about losing those things or those obstacles in our life that take us away from the art and the passion of conversing with another person face to face. One of the reasons I think his material is so rich for the theater too is because of the, you know, the, almost the undercurrent of truth in this world of imagination. I think Fahrenheit 451 is a story that resonates with the young and the old, whether or not they've read the book. These are universal themes, and on stage they really come